Okay. Oh, Ow. oh my gosh. We're in Japan at the moment, if you haven't seen the rest of our vlogs. And we decided that we would pull one of the flavors off the shelf and do a mega challenge. A mega matcha. What's another M word that's like challenge? Madness. <laughs> Mega matcha batter. I like matcha in general. I love matcha. But there's times where it's not nice, like yesterday. Oh, that was that the worst matcha I've ever had. One of the items looks disgusting. It sounds disgusting. It sounds well. disgusting. It looks disgusting in the picture, and I can't imagine it would be nice at all. Let's get to it. Okay, let's go with something easy first. I really want to try these. If you have Daiso in your wherever you're watching from. You'll have seen these, but not the matcha flavor. You've seen like the caramel corn and the brown sugar flavor. They're basically corn puffs, I think. Matcha tohato caramel corn. They're really, really sweet. Ready? Mmm. That's good. Mmm, that Very is good. Sweet. I love it. I love the texture of these things anyway. Oh, okay, camera ring. Earrings that match matcha. Bought them yesterday. What can you do next? Not the beige. <laughs> mm -hmm, you can't help it. Ooh. I'm excited. Okay, so these are matcha Kit Kat. Full disclosure, we've had these before. Oh, they look so cute. It's kind of like a white chocolate with green tea. It's a bit powdery, but still delicious. Mm. And the softness of the chocolate is so soft, and then the crunchy of the wafer. It's essentially like a normal Kit Kat. So good. Really yummy. Mm. Okay. What is that? Next item, green tea milk marshmallow. I thought it looked cute. That it was seems to cute. have like, it's green on the outside, marshmallow, and then it has like a green scent, squishy center. Oh my God. Whoa, that's so weird. So cute. So they're really squishy, see? Mm. Oh, I don't like that. That's strange. And it inside out, it looks really ugly. <laughs> That's the inside. <laughs> it tastes like amp, what ant poison smells yeah, like. Yeah, it's not good. This is what it looks like. Super thin, tasty, appetizing biscuit. <laughs> Sounds legit. <laughs> it just looks like a cracker, but green. It's greenish. It doesn't really look fully much on color. So you get four little pieces in each packet. See? They're so thin. Mmm. There's an aftertaste. Yeah, there's a weird aftertaste. I had one. That'll do me. I don't like that. The aftertaste isn't nice. Yeah. No. But I said I'd like more of these. Oh, these look good. So these are matcha sandwiches. They look like Oreos, but they're fully green. Mm. Head to toe green. Mm. This is Japan. Why you got to package so much? Everything's right. plastic Package everywhere. Everything. But then you have the most difficult bin systems. I don't know how to use the bin system. packaging, you can't even throw it away. I don't, I don't understand mm. it. Okay, I'll go to see. <coughs> Bless you. Bless you, my cookie. Ooh, that smells really weird. That does not smell delicious. What does that smell like? Asshole. <laughs> well, sort of like new shoes. <laughs> okay, one, two, three. Really crunchy. This is tastes a lot like green tea, actually, like matcha. I like that a lot. Next. Oh, those look so good. Mm. Wow. A bit weird, actually. It's like a biscuit, a green tea biscuit, then a layer of chocolate, a layer of green tea chocolate, and in the between that, there's like this gooey stuff. I don't know, it's kind of weird. It looks like film. It does, it looks like a nice big Pretty box of portrait. Oh, they're so tiny. Oh my god. They're very cute. Thank you. Mm. I don't like that inside. Oh, I don't like that. Oh. No. I don't like that. I'm so torn. Did you taste the syrup stuff by itself? No. Like that. I mean, like. Mm, like a Tim Tam. Weird. Mm, don't like it. I don't know. It's alright. 
These things are so good. That's it. That's we got this one from Daiso as well. But they also sell them in Family Mart in smaller boxes, I think. Soy, soy. I haven't seen any soy like anywhere here. Mm. As if. Isn't Jap Japan the home of soy? Oh yeah. Soybeans. <laughs> A perfectly elegant blend of smooth soy milk and delightful flavors of matcha tea. Sounds mm. pretty good. That sounds delicious. I also really love this illustration. See, so cute. It looks like Keith Haring or something. <laughs> you want to do it? Because I always spill it everywhere. Yay, okay, do you want to have a first for me? Oh. Oh. <laughs> that looks disgusting. I'm, I'm such a super fan. Mm. Tastes like a bit oh, like... Good, uh, what, what, what are those tea places called? That serve like all those boba bubble tea things. Oh, yeah. So tasty. At first I thought it was really like soy milky and sometimes there's some really bad tasting soy milk so I was really freaked out. But the matcha actually disguises the soy flavor. Oh god, I can't read this at all. It says... Chocolate... I can't read that one. It says chocolate chip, obviously. Oh yeah, it does. It says chocolate chip. Too focused on like... The katakana. Mm -hmm. Couldn't think about what it would obviously be by saying chocolate. So cute though. They are very cute. I don't like that. I don't taste anything. I do. Oh, it tastes like the weird aftertaste of those little bear cookies. The teddy bears, whatever they're called. What, tiny teddies? Yeah, tiny teddies. No, tiny teddies. You know teddies the strange great. aftertaste of them? That's not strange, it's delicious. It, I it, love tiny teddies. If you like tiny teddies, you'll love it. if you're watching, please send me free tiny teddies. <laughs> so good. So, this one's exciting. Although I can't read any of the writing, I assume it's like a granola. So it's a matcha granola. Yeah. That's pretty good. Oh, oh, it's going oh, in the floor. Oh. It's going in the floor. Oh, I don't want to eat. I will just split that in half. Is there, there's a big old nut in it, is there? What's that? That looks like tofu. Oh, no, but I can't oh my god, nuts. Good. I hope there's no nuts in here. Yeah, Not that I'm allergic. Oh. Plus, I mean, oh, I'm scared. Oh, that smells disgusting. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Taste it! Taste it! Yeah. Not so bad. It tastes like those little tiny cottons you get that are like super long life. So the milk in Australia tastes very different from the milk anywhere else I've had it. I think because we go through a different sterilization process or something, but it's like, it hasn't got that overly creamy texture. I don't know how to explain it. One for you. Thank you. Is that a red bit or is that a mushroom? <laughs> Crunch is so delicious. Mmm. Oh, that's good. That's tasty. Mmm. 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 That's good. What are these things though? Red bean. Mmm. I'm gonna try red bean by itself. The red bean's good. Mmm. Yum. That's good. I definitely recommend that. So crunchy. Mmm. There's little pieces of red bean. They're like fresh red bean. I feel like they're soft. Little pieces of cubed apple, which are dried. I think there's some dried uh, berries in there as well. And the typical puffed grain oats. I love this. I feel like you leave this in milk overnight and it'll still be crunchy the next morning. Oh my god, I'm having more of that later. Since we already have our milk glasses out. Matcha Oreos! And also they're mini Oreos. I love mini Oreos. Because you get so excited about mini Oreos. They're so tasty. <laughs> Should we have one by itself and then try it with the milk? Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Yum! That's good. Mm. That's damn good. First you twist it, then you lick it, then you dunk it. It's hard to dip mini Oreos though, that's really yeah. fall back. That's why you just put them on your spoon and you just go like this. Mmm. You know that they have the <coughs> Oreo cereal in America? Well, is it just that? I don't think so. I think it's like a different, I just think it's like more of a cereal. I've never had it, I can't say. Milk's not so bad anymore. Yeah, you can eat used to it. it. Aww. Oh, awesome. These look so funny. So, these are matcha cashew nuts. There's only like five in there. <laughs> <laughs> you can have the first one. Whoa. Day. 
They're so big. They're on steroids. <laughs> oh my god, they're soft. Like no. they've got a soft coating. Oh, they feel moldy. <laughs> they look moldy. I'm breaking mine apart there. No, I'm not yet. Mmm. Oh, that's mm. Mm. A few moments later. No. Nah. I don't like it. You can't really taste the matcha. It's still like sweet cashews. Jack, trade me your cow. <laughs> <laughs> they actually look like magic beans. The okay, matcha. the creme de la creme. Oh no. The creme. Okay, so this is the next thing that we have. Can you see that? Mm. It's disgusting. Why would anybody want that? Baby, don't judge. Why would anyone want Vegemite? Because it's good. <laughs> <laughs> that should taste damn tasty. Matcha and starch gruel. I really don't want to eat this. Description. Powdery beverage. Oh, how are the ingredients? Sugar, potato starch, koozie starch, matcha. This, this, let's do it. <clears throat> Waiting for the water Hmm. Seemingly innocent packages. Hey, you can see through, that's really cute. <gasps> and it's like anthrax now. It's <laughs> darky. <laughs> <It's dirty. laughs> you get the bombers with the tag on the on the arm. You know what that smells like? Oh, sea God. monkey food. I think it's for old people or something. Oh. That always makes sense. <laughs> How much is 110 mils? Is that enough? Okay, I'm gonna put another half packet in because I feel like I put too much water. I know, I have to have more. Because it's not <laughs> It's disgusting. You put so much in mine. Why would you eat this instead of just matcha? It tastes okay. I have an ice cream mouthful. Yeah. It's so sweet. Just the thing that puts me off is the texture, and I don't like thinking that I'm having potato starch. Like it just doesn't sound. It's like when you boil potatoes in the leftover water or something. I'm surprised at how much I actually don't mind it. We're just gonna eat it for every meal for now. Okay. Oh yeah, so we have two more. We have two more things. This one I've never had. It looks delicious. Oh yum. Do we so get cute. given spoon? No, you have to mm, bring your own. Are... So cute. Oh wait, I forgot to show them. Look. So this is just, I assume matcha pudding. And this is what you get inside. There's four little ones inside. The color's gorgeous. I'm gonna use this color in my work more. Yeah, it really looks like when you have lots of like blackheads. It also looks like an, like an ant farm. Ready? Hmm, it's like a mousse. Very rich. Mmm, really rich. Oh shit, it's like, it's legit like thickened cream. Yeah. Whipped. With green tea. It also tastes like it's cream cheese. I think I would love it if it had like whipped air in it. You know when they're really whipped? Yeah, it's so dense. It's just too dense. It's legit like Philadelphia cream cheese. And you're eating it. Yeah. So we got these the other night. This wasn't for the challenge. This is before we decided to do the challenge. Through the box away, sorry. But it's like by me. Do we have the box? <gasps> we have the box. So this is what it looks like. I would definitely recommend getting these if you're here. It's a bit crushed, but that's what it looks like. It's by Meiji. It's kind of like a, a drumstick cornetto, a waffle cone, and the inside it's coated in, I think, dark chocolate. It's filled with matcha ice cream, and then it's got like a little disc of matcha chocolate on the top, and it's oh, so delicious. I'm so excited. How do I do it? Oh, it's like that. The chocolate disc on the top is delicious. Mmm, so good. I just spurted some life out of it. <laughs> that chocolate dish, the first time I had this, this is the best surprise. Mm. You know how chocolate goes really waxy? This doesn't do that. Breaking news, Meiji is legit. I think Meiji is one of my favorite chocolate brands. Out of the world? Yeah, I'm just never disappointed. Last time we were here, there was banana chocolate everywhere. Mm. And I was like, that's probably gonna taste like crap. Yeah, so it good. It was so good. So good. Meiji, they just never know what they're doing. All right. So, 
I hope you enjoyed our Mega Marcha Magnus challenge. <laughs> if you want us to do more, there's a lot of Halloween themed candy here. So I would like to do some Halloween themed snacks. Please let me know if you want to see that. If you liked it, let us know. I'll leave a link to Rocket's channel um, in the description below. He does a lot of awesome vlogs. Where's my corn puffs gone? They're just there. Oh. Anyway, thanks for watching. We'll see you very soon. Sean, stop eating them. Mm. Sean. Oh, yummy. Sean, stop. Why? Because we should eat some real food. This is real. It's not real. It's made out of corn.